Yo, what's going on everybody? It is straight out of Boston and today I'm back for episode number 36 of my Chicago Bears franchise series here on Madden NFL 17. So today we've got NFC Conference Championship action going on against the Seattle Seahawks after we defeated the Dallas Cowboys in the last episode 38 to 28 in what was a pretty thrilling NFC divisional round of playoff matchup. The Seahawks did defeat the Saints in their divisional round matchup, so that is going to be our opponent this week. We are getting Alshon Jeffrey back. Our highest overall player, remember he injured himself late in the regular season, but he is back now and ready to try and get us back to the Super Bowl for the first time since 2006, I guess it would technically be 2007, would have been the calendar year, but the 2006 season. So here we go from CenturyLink Field in Seattle, the Seahawks ready to go, of course one of the best home field advantages in the NFL. They also support a 90 overall team, so very highly ranked, Russell Wilson one of the best QBs in the league, 34 touchdowns, completed 74% of his passes this year. So you know this is probably going to be our toughest test of the season for our defense. And it's a good start for us before it's a three and out and a punt away. So Felix Olten back to return. And you know what he does on the punt returns. He uses his speed, gets into the open field, and he's going to get all the way to the 46-yard line. A very solid return for Olden. Gives us pretty good field position. So let's see how the Bears take advantage. Adcock dropping back, looking short. He's got Oldham sprinting down the sideline there. And he's got a gain of 22 yards and a first down. And now third and six. Three plays later, Adcock left side. He's got Jeffrey, who's going to get a first down, down to the 7-yard line as we will get first and goal. Now third and goal from the two. It's Adcock looking short. Jeffrey's way, but he fires incomplete. So that's going to set up fourth down. We're going to go for it on fourth down, trying to be aggressive in Seattle. We know that we're going to have to play aggressive to win this game, but it does not pay off here. Adcock gets leveled, and we turn the ball over on downs. So first and ten from their own two-yard line for Seattle. It's a play-action fake. Wilson hit, and he's sacked in the end zone by Jarrell Freeman. And it's going to be a safety for the Bears as they take a 2 to nothing lead, and we do get the ball back now. Diedrich on the screen pass, getting to the outside, down the sideline, across midfield, 35, shoved out of bounds at the 32. A huge gain for Rashawn Diedrich. Now a play-action fake here. Adcock looking left side, he's got Jeffrey into the end zone for the touchdown. Alshon Jeffrey, welcome back, as he's got his first touchdown of the postseason. And the Bears are going to go on top 9 to nothing now. How will Seattle respond? It's Thomas Rawls spinning away. He's going to get a gain of about 8 on that one, as now it's going to be 3rd and 8 from the 36. Wilson later in the same drive, scrambling to the left side now, trying to make something happen. Fires across his body on the run. Unreal throw, and Baldwin makes a man miss. He is in. Touchdown, Doug Baldwin. What a play by Russell Wilson, though, keeping the play alive. I don't know how he made that throw so accurately, but either way, Seattle on the board. It's now 9-7. Diedrich on the handoff here in the second quarter. He's going to pick up a gain of six right there. We uh, did not run the ball as effectively this game. I stuck with Diedrich over our other halfbacks after Diedrich had some success against Dallas late in the second half last week, but uh, Seattle's run defense a lot better than Dallas is, so we really struggled to run the ball with no matter who we use that running back. There it's KJ Wright getting back there for the sack. That's going to set up second and 19 now. Adcock with a deep drop back firing over the middle. He's got LaBreeze Barden for the first down, a gain of 24, and Adcock now 9 of 10 already. He has had a fantastic start to this game, and he's got Jeffrey for the second time today, his second touchdown of the afternoon, as it's going to be a 16-7 game now for the Seahawks as they take over midway through the second quarter. Wilson firing this one on the run deep, but he overthrows his man, and Will Hill the third was there for the interception. So a huge play by Will Hill. We get the ball back. We would eventually punt it right back to Seattle, so they got the ball on the 14-yard line. There is a sack for Leonard Floyd there as he went unblocked and sacked Russell Wilson there. Now, second and 17 play action fake. It's that man again, Leonard Floyd, combining with, I think that was Pernell McPhee. Now third and 22 from the two-yard line. Already one safety today. Let's make it two. It was Frank Clark and Jarrell Freeman, of course. The middle linebacker, the former Colt, Jarrell Freeman, getting back there. His second sack for a safety so far today. So here we go, 18-7 is the score. A little bit awkward, but we're going to work with it. That's a first down toss to Cornelius. Now, first and 10. It's a fumble, and that's going to be recovered by Elliott. He's going to take it all the way. A fumble, six on the cornerback blitz as Adcock once again victimized by a strip sack. It has been a problem for him so far in these playoffs. And so far, we had played a mistake-free game. I thought that was going to be a big key to beating the Seattle team. But that was our first big mistake of the day. So how will Adcock and the Bears offense respond? Still some time to put up some points in this half. He's looking over the middle. He's got Oldham, who's got a first down across midfield to the 29-yard line now. 30 seconds to play. Adcock dropping back. Tons of time fires left side. He's got Colby Listenby 
who's got the first down grab on the curl route. Timeout Chicago. Now first and 10 from the 13. Adcock looking short. He's got Jeffrey breaking away. And I'll shot Jeffrey's into the end zone for the third time this afternoon. Now opening drive of the second half. Adcock looking deep for Jeffrey once again. Jeffrey breaking free. And Al Sean Jeffrey is taking over this football game. His fourth touchdown of the game. Unbelievable. He's already up over 200 yards. Welcome back, Al Sean Jeffrey. As Adcock not looking to work him back into the mix slowly as he went right after him this game. And Al Sean having a big game. He's rewarding his quarterback. So here we go, 32 to 14. He is uh, looking deep though, is Wilson, and he's got his man there for a first down, so the Seahawks looking to answer back with some points of their own. CJ Procise into the game now, after Thomas Rawls was shaken up. Procise has the first down run right there, now third and 13 later on the same drive. Wilson looking, he's got Graham, but Graham is going to be stopped short of the first down marker by a few yards, so fourth and three coming up. Hauschka's kick is up and good. So Seattle cuts the lead down to 50 now, it's 32 to 17. Adcock and the Bears offense back onto the field, and they're going right back to work here. Like I said, really we weren't able to run the ball at all this game, so even when we were up big, like by two scores and it's the third quarter, I'm not really even deferring to the run game. I still want to be aggressive, try to keep putting points up on the board, run the ball when I can, and you know, still try to run clock, but more than anything else, just try to keep the ball moving and try to keep the momentum in our favor. And I think we did that pretty effectively on this drive. There's Will Ty making the grab. He is going to be brought down right at the two yard line. Now first and goal from the two. It's Adcock dropping back. He's going to look right side this time. He's got Will Ty into the end zone for the touchdown. Fifth touchdown toss of the day for Adcock. And it's 39 to 17 now. Here we go. Tyler Lockett making a man miss there. He's going down the sideline showing off the speed. As he's got a big game for Seattle. They need some big plays now. Down 22 points in the fourth quarter. It's Procise on the screen pass making a man miss. There goes CJ Procise, the former Fighting Irish. And there he goes down to the four yard line now. Third and goal. Wilson fires this one out of the back of the end zone. Incomplete. Fourth down. And they are going to go for it here. Not settling for any field goals. And it's Procise getting stuffed at the goal line. And the Bears take over. So we would have to punt it from our own end here. But take a look at this punt by O'Neill as Lockett is going to kind of let this one go and then go decide to pick it up. And he's actually going to fumble around with it a bit. We could have recovered there. It would have been epic. But instead, Hollier is just going to tackle him at the four-yard line. So that was a net, like, 80-yard punt, probably even more than that. And then we're going to get our third safety of the day. This time, Adrian Amos on the free safety blitz. It was another play-action pass. Those never work for the CPU in Madden when you send the blitz and uh, it worked out for us right there. Then later, play action fake. Look at Adcock just toying with this defense. Cornelius breaking two tackles and he is gone. 48-17, icing on the cake and that is going to do it. We would run the clock out from there. Seattle, no match for us today as we are moving on to the Super Bowl for the first time since 2006. 48-17 is your final. Kirby Adcock, a phenomenal day. 471 passing yards, six touchdowns, completed more than 80% of his passes. His passer rating was a perfect 158.3 on the day. An incredible performance by him. Alshon, the same thing, over 200 yards, four touchdowns, an incredible performance by him. And our defense played well, holding Seattle to just 17 points as they have a pretty potent offensive attack, especially with Russell Wilson back there quarterbacking that offense. But there you can see Adcock stats, 30 of 37, 478 yards. I was actually sold him short a little bit there. Jeffrey, 15 grabs for 217 yards and four touchdowns. Frank Clark, second half. Freeman, second half. We had the safeties on defense. That was big. And the Will Hill turnover. So that's going to do it. Hope you guys enjoy. Thanks for watching. And I will see you in the Super Bowl.